everyone, welcome back. Okay, makeup show haul. I just got home. It is literally six o'clock at night. I've been up since 4 a.m. <clears throat> and I went to the makeup show in New York with my girlfriends, Victoria, Tiffany, and Veronica. And we had one fun day and a lot of shopping. I have no rhyme or reason in these bags, so we're just gonna start with one and go from there. So this is one bag. This is my bag from the house here. Uh, the first booth I hit today, just for starters, Makeup Forever. But I don't even know where that bag is. Okay, let's see here. Nope, oh, here is the Makeup Forever bag. Okay, so we'll get that one out of the way. Hope everyone's had a wonderful day. It's Monday. Okay, <clears throat> Makeup Forever. I picked up the Water Blend Foundation. Um, in this, I'm in the shade Y415. I picked up two of the Ultra HD foundations. I'm in um, 165R420. So those are my main ones. What else we got in here? Got a little mixer. Uh, two more sets of static nails. So I picked up these. Summer Girl Jasmine. Thanks, Jazz. I paid for them, but guys, I have her thanks. But these are two new ones. Uh, back to Makeup Forever. What do we got in here? Oh boy. Wait a minute. Ah! Oh, okay. See, I'm really mixing up. Guerlain, I got the last um, La Petite Robe Noir Black Lash Dress Mascara. So I picked that up from the Guerlain booth. Back to Makeup Forever. Uh, Artist Acrylips. These are these here. So I, this is like a berry shade. I don't even know what numbers these are. Um, 501. And they had like a deal of buy five and you get 50% off instead of 40%. So I was like, why not? I'll buy five. Kind of a pinky purple color. We got here. Oh, I picked up the liquid mats. Figured I'd give them a shot. Of course, this looks way too light, but still never know. This is 105. Another artist liquid mat. I think this should be 109. Yes. We'll see how I do with these. They don't look the same shade in the tube. Uh, another artist. Acrylip, Acrylip, I don't know how they say it. This is hot pink. That is 201. Then they have these new ones coming out, I guess, I don't know, maybe in the fall. Aqua XL Color Paints. You can use it, you know, highlighter, blush, you can do whatever you want. So I did pick up a white. Um, it's a good base for eyeshadow. And then... I was playing with this on the train because I managed to dig down in. This is shade I-80, which is an iridescent, like a pink beige shade, I guess you'd call it. I don't know. Oh, I washed my hand. I don't know if it's still in here. It's actually right here on my hand. It's actually really pretty. But at the show, of course, they were a great deal. Um, I stopped at the Friends Beauty, Blue Beauty booth. And I picked up, let's see here, three of the Viseart. And this time, since I own all the shadows now, now I started on blush palettes. So this is Rose Coral, um, number two. I want to get a coffee or a drink. I don't know how long this is going to go. I tried to be good. Zero three, which is Orange Violet. If the lighting's weird, I took off one of the covers on my light boxes because I was trying to shoot some indoor. So if that's thrown off the color in here, sorry, I'm just too tired to put it back up. It's been a long day. Hey, we still got my wristband on. And this is 01 Plum Bronze. I'm just glad those made it home in one piece because that was always my biggest fear of I'm going to break them on the way home because I was carrying four bags. Okay. 
Oh, now that I of course I have dog hair all over it because the dogs bum rush me. Veronica made us all our own bags to take. Is this not adorable? It has mesh and all the beauty stuff. So mine has the B for Brenda and then she made one for Tiffany. They had a T and um, Victoria had a V. Oh, just so cool. So thank you, Veronica. Love the bag. Um, I stopped at Z-Pal. <laughs> They're in one of these bags, I don't know. Uh, crown brush. The booth was crazy when I hit crown, so I just walked up to what I could actually grab and picked up uh, two of, are they marked? Probably not. A fan brush, and this is the BK8 Deluxe Soft Fan Brush. And I picked up one, and that was all I grabbed because the thing was just crazy. I found a new brand. I'm guessing it's just called Note. Met the owner, beautiful woman. She was very sweet. And I wanted to try her products. So I picked up three different lipsticks. I picked up a matte, it's called a matte moist lip gloss, a long wearing lip gloss, and a rich color lipstick. And this one is called Black Violet, number 24. Totally my shade. And I like that they even have their name embossed into it. Gorgeous. I don't know what I do with that box. Hold on. Try not to lose anything. Long wearing lip gloss. Totally my kind of shade. Yeah, this light's definitely messing with stuff. I'll fix it for the next video, I swear. Uh, this is the Matte Moist Lip Gloss 403 in Sugar Kiss. This actually looked deeper on me when she swatched it, so I'm hoping it comes a little deeper. And then she had this beautiful blusher called the Terracotta Blusher, and this is 03 Oriental Pink. This is their packaging. Nope, on the front. How gorgeous is that? You know this is going to be highlighter too. But it's watched beautifully. It's a really nice product. Okay. Let's see what else we got here. Um, see some of the bags I kept. This was, I stopped at the It booth. It Cosmetics was there. Oh, here's the Z palettes. Picked up three more extra large. I'm just going to put those right here. Oh, my water. I don't know if this is in here. I'm finding a sample from a more Pacific. I don't know where that came from. Beauty So Clean. Love my Beauty So Clean. And this has all the brush cleaners and the wipeout and sanitizer mist and little one. This is the, so it smells like cake, cake pop. Great for your bag. They have like a, kind of like a Vera Mona thing that you can use. My wipes that I use all the time. And this cool little towel. Dropping everything here. It says, this is sanitized. So it's nice big. Great for drying your brushes on though. So that was my beauty so clean. Dropping stuff as usual. What else is new, right? Wait a minute. I'm so sore, sorry. Move those back. And then while I was at the makeup show, they don't give you a big bag when you walk in, which for some reason I totally spaced. So I bought another bag. It says the makeup show. And I got the purple one. Let's see what's in this one. Oh my God. Okay, this is gonna be totally random. Uh, Senna Cosmetics. I was eyeing this and I had to have this. 
So they gave it to you in a cute bag here. This is the packaging, which you probably can't see. And this is called called Rose Quartz. This is Divine Shine. Wait, do you see this? Oh Lord. Yeah. I cannot wait to play with this. But you know I have to photograph everything first, but wow, gorgeous. So that was from Senna. What else we have here? Um, Dr. Brandt was there, so I picked up the Needles No More Plump Fix 3D. I'm always up for a good little plumper, so I actually picked up another one from another place, too. Ah, uh, so this is just all thrown in here. The IT CC Plus Illumination SPF 50. I picked up the shade Tan. The IT card. Oh, Smashbox bag. Get that out of the way. Uh, Juvia's Place. I picked up they have this, um, the pink brush set. So I grabbed that. Oh, IT Cosmetics again. This is the um, Confidence in Your Glow, and I picked the shade. Where is it? Okay. Of course, I gotta have these crazy claws. I don't know what shade I got here. Which one did I get? Well, it says instant warm glow. I don't know. Still not telling me how. I. It just says instant warm glow. What's this one? Is there plastic on this? No, oh, maybe not. What is this? This is weird. Okay. So this one here. I guess it's warm glow. Uh, Juvia's, I picked up the blush palette. This was $17.50 at the show and $18 online. Not a big discount, but hey, I was there. The, the first palette was way too dark. The shades, I would have absolutely no use for the first one. Even to use them as shadows, they were just very, very dark. This one's gorgeous. Look at that one. Real nice. Obviously, like I said, we'll get more into swatching and all that, but I had a lot of pictures to take first. All right, what else we got here? I don't know where I'm at. Oh, I hit the, um, I don't want to break any of these. That's all of them. The Cosette or Cosetti. So I picked up a purple, a pink, what else I got here? Kind of another taupey color, a gold, a couple mattes, brown, blue, kind of a peach shade, and a blue shade. So those will go together with the other ones. I think I picked up seven here, seven, eight. I don't want to drop them. I'm going to put these back in here. So lose them over here. I just put a little table on the side over me over here. That right there. So. Okay, what else we got in here? <laughs> just pull stuff out. Uh, Delium tools. You know, I love my Delium. So, this time I picked up. That out of the way. Oh my god. I was on a fan brush kick today. So I picked up this big monster one. This is Face 991. Uh, Face 925, which I already have this brush. But I picked up another one. And 925. So I got one in yellow, one in pink. I also picked up two of their matte lipsticks, which are sealed. So we'll get to these on another day. It's, I picked up two darker shades, of course. Wait a minute and last call. So it's kind of like two berry shades. Okay. 
Well, Smashbox, give me a free little bag. Oh, Juvia's gave me a free eyeshadow. Very cool. Angola. Yay. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I'm getting into the Smashbox here, it looks like. I bought a lot of Smashbox, too. I picked up their Studio Skin 15 Hour Wear Foundation in shade 3.35. Um, the Casey Holmes, since I already had the pearl while I was there, I figured I'd pick up the Spotlight Gold. So grab that one. Might as well have them both. Picked up another Cover Shot palette. I don't know if you can see how it does. This is the one Golden Hour. Kind of like more neutrals, which is fine. Cool. Then since they had the, um, the new Be Legendary Liquid Metal and the liquid pigment lipsticks. I picked up four of them. So we have Iced Out, which is a blue, Foiled Brat, kind of a magenta, Rose Before Bros, kind of like a rose color, and Crush It, which you can see is like a, my kind of berry shade. So I picked up four of those. These look really pretty. Going. What is in here? Oh, yeah. I want. I don't own a lot of Kevin Aquan. I do now. Okay. I picked up the Neo Highlighter Illuminator. Which let's see if we can open this here. Yes. I think these range like almost 60 and they were like 30 so it's got the nice you know velvet case for those prices it should this packaging it goes deeper to lighter it's pretty though for that price I said why not back in here. Can I show you all that? Okay, I'll never get that back in the box. We're not a spacer. I'm just putting stuff here. And the Molten Lip Colors. These run, I think, brand new. Or retail. I want to say 30. And they were 18. I bought three of them. They looked fun. So, I think there's five shades, so I got three of the five. And of course, now I won't be able to read any of them here. Okay, Carbon, which is this dark, it's actually like a berry purple. Rose Gold is here. And Titanium is here. So I figured I'd give these a whirl. Why not? Still going. Oh, got the Kat Von D Alchemist palette. That was 20, normally what, 32, something like that. I stopped at Nigel's Beauty Emporium. Oh, wait, I got another Smashbox. Uh, Be Legendary Liquid uh, Mauve Wife. So actually, I bought five of them. I'm at Juvia's car here. Wait a minute. What do I got here? Oh, the Makeup Show book. Okay, I think that's all. When I, get, I don't remember what I got at Nigel's. Oh. oh, I got a couple orders in here, too. I picked up the Hourglass palette. And it was no $80, obviously, because I wouldn't pay for that. This one looks like marble. This one here. Don't grab 
that. What else do we got? It was just a whirlwind. Okay. Oh, this new brand seems really cool called Dream Weave and Company. So here is their card. Um, from Australia. Woman was, you know, had the beautiful accent. She was so sweet. They do lip plumpers. So this one's called Chamber Made Turn Up the Voltage. It has seven custom settings. So you can go from a cool tingle all the way to the hot tingle. And then they also had mascaras. So they were doing two for 20. So they either had like where it's more of a serum to grow, but I just got the regular mascara. So another lip pumper and a mascara from Dream Weave and Company. So I'm definitely going to give them a shot and I'll keep you updated on that because we like those small businesses. Oh, last but definitely not least. Okay. All the Nigels, just so you know, the um, Hourglass, $48. So works for me. And then I had to stop at Vail and say hello to Sebastian. I love Sebastian. He is the sweetest man and makes fabulous products. As you know, I'm obsessed with them. So I picked up two more, like I said I would, of my Sunset Light base, my priming base, which is here. So I picked up two more of those. And I picked up another foundation. This one I changed the color. The one I have is a bit light for me. So I went up a notch. So the one I have here, I believe is three, three G medium. So I went up to the darker section up to four. And I, this is tan four N. The color probably won't look right on here. But we tried the 4N on me, and that should neutralize the, my redness and everything. <clears throat> but these two in combination, just fabulous. But you know I love my veil. And I love Sebastian. He's so sweet. Okay. I'm pretty sure that's... <laughs> I did some damage, but I saved for this all year, don't forget. So I don't want you to think I just go out and go ballistic and, you know, spend hundreds of dollars on makeup. I don't. I save all year. I mean, even the girls were already laughing of... Start saving for next year. Got to be ready. Okay. I am exhausted. I am going to upload this so you can, guys can see all the fun I had. I'm going to go eat something. and probably pass out because I have to go to work tomorrow. But what a fun day. I had a great time seeing everyone, everyone at the show. It was just fun seeing everyone. I had a great, great time. And I hope you all had a fabulous day and hope you liked the haul. And if you want Obviously, I got to photograph everything, but we'll get into swatches and all the funness of does it work, does it not work, and the new brands, and we're going to have some fun. Okay, everyone have a fabulous night, and I'll see you all soon. Bye!